What up guys, Payne here once again, welcome back to my Manchester United career on Football Manager 2014 And that's right, our next game is to be played away at St James's Park against Newcastle United You're going to see that as well as our first game in the Champions League group stage this season against Lyon We're going to be playing away and as I mentioned in my previous video, I think we can just edge it Looking at the league table we are level on points with the Baggers, West Brom and also Chelsea. Uh, but I think we can pick up a win at St. James's Park. I think we could go for it. I'm going to go now straight to team selection and let's see what we can do. So it looks like the majority of my top players are fit for the game. It's all about just choosing the right team now. That's, that's pretty much it. So keeping in mind that we've got a, a big game against Leon midweek. It's a game that seeing that we're kicking off the Champions League you wanna have a good start so I need to be careful with the players that I pick I am thinking of maybe bringing Nani back into the team because his return from injury now he was out for a couple of weeks um, he missed all of pre-season I think coming back to face Newcastle would be okay for him but I'm gonna go for Kagawa for this game on the uh, the left wing should I bring in Chris Small then Ryan Giggs, you know what, I might keep Ryan Giggs for that Leon game simply because he's got the experience of Champions League and he can bring that to the team so I think I might stick with Carrick in midfield um, we have Ferdinand, I don't know whether I want to stick with Mata down that right wing for the time being I could bring in Antonio Valencia again, someone else that's returned from injury Ryan Giggs I'm going to I'm going to bring in Tom Cleverley to replace Fellaini and I could play Fellaini midweek. He can get in amongst the pigeons <laughs> and just grind them down. He's a ball winning midfielder. Um sh I don't want to start Yanis. I will leave him on the bench. Chris Smolin and Phil Jones in center half. Now, I'll keep that as it is with Vidic um teaming up with Jones as center halves for this game. Same with Ever and Raphael. I think that's a pretty decent back four. Uh, it's it's going to be harsh to leave Ashley Young off the bench as well, considering that his average rating is 7.2. But I'm going to go ahead anyway. Let's see what we can do against Newcastle United with this team. So I believe Man United have enough about themselves to see off Newcastle today. Newcastle's task will not be made any easier by the absence of Debushi and Remy. Ooh, they're missing those two players. That's a huge knock for Newcastle United. So they got Ben Arthur, Papis Cisse, Teote, Oberton, former Man United player, and Jack Cork. We'll want to use Soko, Gufran, and I think that should be it. So if we do that, sweet. Let's go to Team Talk. We are the favourites here, so we need to remind players not to let the fans down. Cool, calm, have faith in you, go out there. Let's get another good win. Add another set of three points to the league table. Everyone is looking happy, keeping that confidence nice and high. Here we go. As we kick off against Newcastle, I just wanted to get some feedback from you guys. In my previous episode, some of you mentioned that I should only record when a month has been played and just show you guys all the results, who scored and so on, and some of the main headlines. Oh, look at that, Robin Van Persie, ninth goal this season, and we're only four games in. Amazing stuff. He's running rampant at Manchester United at the moment. But yes, anyway, let me know in the comment section below, should I do that? Should I just show you guys a month's worth of results every video? Be sure to let me know in the comments below. Rooney to Cleverley. Nice back heel from Cleverley. Just knew exactly where Van Persie was. And Van Persie slots that one behind to make it 1-0 to United. Kagawa offside. Who's, who got the yellow card? It was Phil Jones. Getting stuck in. That's what I like. Matter to Rooney. Working together nicely. Good defending by Raphael. Van Persie. He was looking for Kagawa. He's still got it. Is it 2-0? No, it's not. Crawl with a decent save. Newcastle on the break. Going for that counter attack, but Raphael there again. Got a corner. Rooney. Sweet. Michael Carrick with the goal. Rooney was the one that took the corner. 
Swung that one in. And I think it was Carrick with his left foot. Kind of looked like it was his left foot with the 2D. Yeah, it was his left foot. Not his best. But a beautiful goal. And 2-0 up against Newcastle United. I couldn't have asked for a better start. 2-0 up before half-time. Beautiful. Kagawa, Van Persie, Rooney, Carrick, Mata, Raphael. 3-0 coming up. Surely. Oh, we've got a free kick here. Van Persie's going to step up to take this. Just like it. It's kind of like a corner. Just a yard or so away. 3-0. My word. We are just running away with this. Village to the goal scorer. So sweet. Newcastle United always seem to be a bit of a challenge, but we're overcoming them. Van Persie with the free kick. Van Vidic, bags of space. And players are starting to look calm and relaxed. We could even get a fourth here. Holy crap, we almost did. Can we get a fourth before half time? Certainly something to aim for. Something is brewing. Oh boy. Come on, let's have that fourth goal. Looking for that overlap. We need back to Kagawa. Everett. Ah, we're going to go in half time. 3 0 up. Oh, just look at that. For that magnificent play. Everett. Off the post. Van Persie. Got a corner. Colacini just sticking out of foot. No, we're definitely not going to get a fourth now. Raphael going in with the challenge. Mata coming all the way back. And there we have it, half time. 3 0 up against Newcastle. I just hope we don't throw it all away now. Performance has been excellent. Could be passionate about this. Keep it up, lads. Oh, everyone's looking extremely delighted. I don't think I need to bring on anyone at the moment. Let's see how we uh, fare up to the 60th minute or so. And then we'll uh, evaluate some players I could possibly take off. I can imagine Alan Pardew. Pulling out some of his hair in that dressing room at half time. With the players of Newcastle. Ah, oh, Cissé. Good save to hair. They've got a corner. Can we defend it though? Yes, we can. To hair. Straight into the hands. Let's watch our time. Cleverly has picked up a knock. Ooh, I'm going to have to take him off. I don't want to risk Cleverly injuring himself even more. So I'm going to I'm gonna take him off. Um, let's see who we can bring on. I'm thinking Nani. Could drop Kagawa back into central midfield. I know it's not his preferred position. And I could bring on Nani. I think that should work. Um, could be assertive. I think there's a lot more to come for you. And I completely believe... You've got what it takes. He's deep in thought. Go on, go and get your first goal of the season for us. Go and make it 4-0. Newcastle. Jones needs to be careful. I don't need him getting sent off. Cissé looking dangerous. Hitting the side netting. Cleverly should go off now, yeah. Tactical changes. Nanny takes his place. I'm thinking about taking off Van Persie. Because I'd hate for him to pick up a knock. Right, let's make it in the 70th minute let's bring on I know Van Persie's doing amazing but I'm going to bring on Hernandez and I'm also going to bring on Yanazai for Mata I'm not going to talk to them just go out there have a good time we're winning this game 3-0 up against Newcastle decent result if we can keep it that way I don't really see Newcastle getting back into this one though now. Maybe even get Hernandez on the score sheet. That'd be... Oh, Evra not picking up Gufran. So unfortunate. What was Evra doing? He was just standing there. Watch Cork's pass. With the through ball, Evra didn't even bother chasing that one down. Gufran just too quick for Evra. So unfortunate. Raphael's also picked up a yellow card. He was looking complacent. Seems calm now. Evra's looking very tired. Well, I've made all three subs now. Ref should blow his whistle. There we go. Final score 3-1 to Manchester United. Decent win. Um, that was a real Jekyll and Hyde performance from you. You were fantastic in the first half. 
but the second half shown was unacceptable. Um, I'm very happy with the result and the way you played. So, yeah, that'll do. Everyone was happy, apart from the uh, the players that didn't come on. <laughs> Sweet. And we stay top of the table. But all the other teams in the league have a game in hand. Right, let's take a look at this then. Who am I taking on the trip to France to play Lyon? Let's have a look who's available. Fellaini. Right, I'm going to start Ryan Giggs. Oh, I'm going to start Ryan Giggs instead of uh, Michael Carrick, who's looking exhausted at the moment. And I'm thinking... I'm thinking Marouane Fellaini replacing Cleverly. Johnny Evans, should I play him? No, I think... We'll leave Vidic in for experience. Jones. Actually, you know what? I'll play Chris Smolin. Raphael, I think he's okay there as well. Evra, when is our next game? It's going to be on the weekend against Hull. I'll play Evra then. Even though he's at 88%. I'll play Evra for this game. It's important to get a good start in the Champions League. Um, but then I'll probably play Butner for that game against Hull. At Old Trafford. Um, Kagawa. Let's put Nani in for Kagawa. He didn't do too bad. Matter, yeah, we'll keep him on. And can I play Danny well? But nah, that was never going to happen. He can't play in that central attack in mid roll. Ashley Young can't. Valencia can't. Damn, I've just had a brainwave. It's staring right at me. You guys are probably going mad as well. I could play Mata in the central attack in mid-roll. And I could take Rooney off for Valencia. I'm going to rest Rooney, but he's going to be on the bench in replace of Hernandez. Just in case we slip up and we have a spot of bother against Leon. Right, I think I'm happy with that. I just now want to quickly go across to well to player roles. I wanted to have a look at Ryan Giggs, central midfielder. I think we can keep it at that. Attack support. We'll stick with attack. And for Laney, could go for box to box midfielder, but actually ball winning midfielder. That's what I want for Laney to be doing. I want him to be in support and just Putting the opposition under pressure. Matter. Advanced playmaker. Could go for Ingosh. Um, that's probably not even how you pronounce it. I'm going to stick with advanced playmaker though for Matter. And I think Van Pers is okay for the time being. So let's submit. Let's go take on Leon in the Champions League group stages. It's our first game in the Champions League this season. First game in the group stage. United against Leon, playing away from home. It's going to be difficult, but I think we can rise to it. What on earth was that? Was that supposed to be a shot, or was it supposed to be a cross? De Gea saving it anyway. Gigs to Mata. Nani so close to opening up the scoring. Good save by the keeper. Mata with the corner. Go on, Gigs, chase it down. Put them under pressure. A free kick here for Leon. Ever coming in. Ever's fitness is a worry as well. We need to watch out for that. Come on, Valencia. You can do better than that. They're going to open up the score in here if we're not careful. De Gea again. Good save. And they are just pressurizing us here. Pinning us back. We need to get out of this situation. De Gea with a decent save. Clutches it to his chest. Let's change this to attacking. I'm not happy about this pressure coming from Leon. <sighs> Again. Why are they going for long shots like that? Oh, that's off for Van Persie. Giggs, Nani. Oh, decent save by the Leon keeper. That's all it's been so far. Decent save by the keeper. Oh, good save. <laughs> Back down to Van Persie from Mata. I thought Van Persie picked up an injury there. We need to pick it up. We need to pick up the pace here. We need to go and get that opening goal and try and settle ourselves. 
and grow into this game. As you probably saw just a little earlier on, we have dropped down to second in the group. I think Dortmund are winning, or maybe Anderlecht and Mata has opened up the score in here. Second goal of the season for United. And we move up to first in the group. Let's see that goal again. Nani Evra, Giggs working well together. And Giggs was the guy that set it up. Assisted the goal for Mata. He definitely plays better in that central attacking mid role. Can we go for a second? I'll never be happy with just one. One goal. Ever and Nani working nicely together. Matter looking for a second goal of the game. Giggs with the corner. Giving that one to Matter. It's worked out nicely. Oh, keeper with the save again. It's going out for Van Persie, Matter. Our set pieces are working out so far. That was nice by Giggs. Looking for uh, a player outside the box. Fellaini winning the ball. Haven't seen much of Valencia in this game. Ryan Giggs! Ryan Giggs running down the wing. Makes it 2-0 for Manchester United. Who would have thought he would have got on the score sheet in this game? Oh, sensational stuff. Sensational. The question is, how does he do it? Ryan Giggs, seriously. Fellaini coming in, winning the ball again. Mata, Giggs, Nani, ever in space. Nani, another shot from Nani on his left foot. Go for outside the box, finds Mata. Oh, I can't swing it in, but we've got to throw in. As we come up to half time. Ever's looking complacent. It's okay, he, sh he should be okay for the whole of the, the 90 minutes. Because I haven't actually brought um, Butner with me. Pleased with the way it's going, guys. Keep it going. Let's keep going on with this game. Lacazette has come on for Leon. That's interesting. Flamboyant striker, the age of 22, 23. Mount Bronx picked up an injury. Vintage player. Fulham legend. With Leon making that substitution, they are starting to look a bit desperate and who would blame them? 2-0 down at half-time. Look at Lacazette. He's all over the pitch. His work rate, amazing. Getting himself in between the action. We need to be careful of him. Can't afford to give them space. Small and do, doing well there. That challenge. Come on, Rafa. What are you playing at? It's 2-1. They're back in the game. Let's see that goal again. It all started from Lacazette. It was Danique, is that? Who started off the attack. Raphael just wasn't closing him down. Right, let's make a substitution. Got some players looking pretty tired out there. Could do with the Anazite. Nani hasn't been doing that well. I'm thinking... Danny Welbeck. Wow, Van Persie. 6.2 rating throughout this game. That's embarrassing. Have faith in you. He looked happy, Yanazai. And Welbeck seemed deep in thought. So all I want now is just one more goal and we can settle down and go back to Manchester with those three points in the group stage. Dortmund have just got the equaliser against Anderlecht. Oh, Danny Welbeck, surely. Ryan Giggs, lucky for that third goal. It's 2-1 oh, now to Dortmund against Anderlecht. They are certainly having most of the possession here. Uh, Leon. It's 3-1 to Dortmund. We drop down to second because of goal difference. Benzia throw on goal. It's 2-2. Oh my. Right in the 80th minute. Shoot, get rid of that. Don't want to upload the goal. You're going to see it anyway on YouTube. Benzia found Gomez and he just volleyed that home. I want to change my instructions if I can. Let's get back to live. Let's go over to that. Oh, Yanazai just scored! 3 2! Oh, it's disallowed, you fucking linesman. As we go for overload. 
Got four added minutes. Oh, don't tell me they're going to get a winner here. Oh, that would be injustice, that. That would be injustice if they got a winner. <sighs> De Gea tipping that one over. They've got another corner. Full time, two all. Not a bad game, but it's just a shame we threw it all away in the second half. Such a shame. Very, uh, yeah, the performance was disappointing, but I want to keep morale nice and high, ready for that game on the weekend against Hull in the Premier League. It was only Ryan Giggs that seemed demotivated, but everyone else looked fired up.